the 10 worst places in the world to get caught with cannabis. The laws surrounding cannabis, from its legality to the difference between personal recreational use and intention to supply, vary across the globe. The matter is not made any clearer when it comes to the USA, where in some states, possession of cannabis is seen as a more serious crime than possession of cocaine. If there is one consistent place where you never want to get caught with cannabis, though, it's in your bedroom by your mother or father. The fight to legalize cannabis continues unabated and in parts of Europe, notably Holland, while possession of cannabis is still illegal, it goes unpunished as a crime. While possession is a crime in the UK, the law is becoming more relaxed and, invariably, if it is clear you are just a recreational user, a smack on the wrist is the worst you will get. So, in the format of the game show Pointless, which countries do you think have the harshest penalties for being caught in possession of cannabis? We think there are a few places on the list that will remain pointless as none of you will mention them. In the land of the setting sun, don't watch it going down while smoking a joint as you'll spend the next five years in a Japanese jail. It's hard to imagine that anywhere in South America would have a problem with cannabis, but if caught with it in Colombia, expect to spend around six years in jail. There are a couple of countries on the old Eastern Bloc that don't smile kindly on potheads, one being Lithuania. Expect a six and a half year stretch here. Be careful if you go to Cyprus on holiday. Just imagine those long days filled full of sunshine crystal blue waters and sandy beaches, all just out of reach as you spend eight years admiring the view from your cell window. Not surprisingly, Russia makes it onto the list, though with a less than harsh than expected nine and a half year stretch on average. Slovakia has surprised us, sneaking in at number four with the most respectable 12 and a half year period of detention. As we near the end of the list, there is the United Arab Emirates, or UAE. Hardly a surprise in an area where alcohol is only permitted in certain areas that possessing cannabis will see you locked away for anything up to 15 years. Saudi Arabia is just as harsh. Then, how could we forget the backdrop of the harrowing film Midnight Express? Not much has changed since, so don't get caught with any dope in Turkey or you can kiss goodbye to 18 years of your life. If you like the occasional joint, give Nigeria a wide berth. 25 years in jail awaits anyone caught with cannabis. Seems a bit harsh when you don't even get that long in prison for trying to overthrow the government. Then, grouped together, we have the Philippines, Cambodia and Singapore, where life imprisonment is not unheard of, nor is execution. So, have you got any names you like to add to the list? We do not hope through personal experience. Leave a note in the comments section below to let everyone know where they should cross off from their holiday list. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, do like and subscribe so you too can become a cannabis expert.